Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 22 of Let's Play Terra Enigma, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, I did a little bit of backtracking, so I went to this area south of, south of the bridge, or like east and then south of the bridge, to come to this tree right over here. Why? It turns out there was actually a hidden chest around here that I did not know where it was at the time. I mean, it was out of the way and very difficult to spot. You would probably have to come across it by fluke. And there, it was a life potion. So we get some extra health, which is always a good thing. I hope I didn't lose sight on where I need to go. I know I gotta head east. It's just a matter of getting there. But first, let's kill some more bats. There's always time for killing bats. But I just gotta be extra careful because I do lose a lot of health easily at this point. Those saber dogs have a lot to do with it. So now I'm back to the dark part of the forest. There we got past the centipedes. the warlocks are coming up. Yep, they're here. Better get rid of this one. That way I can dodge the flames. Don't want to rush it. Ooh, one shot. Isn't it great? Okay, did I go beyond this point? I don't remember. I think I might have just stopped around here or somewhere nearby. I could be wrong. Either way, I, a little bit of extra experience wouldn't hurt, and there was a dead end. So I guess I'm going this way. I mean, aside from the enemies that can be frustrating, this place is not too bad. I mean, you can easily get lost because, well, it's a forest. It wouldn't be a forest if you can't get lost at all. Well, some forests are very easy to know where to go, but you get the idea. They always portray the forest as a place you can easily get lost in. Trust me, Zelda's been doing that for years. Ooh, I want to see another chest. Dog whistle. Wait, if I remember the books over in Loire, they said something about a dog whistle taming dogs. Well, that's what a dog whistle does. I mean, tames Brian and Family Guy. Surely can tame some dogs here. If not here, but maybe somewhere else that's significant. Perhaps Storkholm? Or is it still the matter of getting there? I'm sure there's another route. Seems out the first one is out. Yeah, that rhymes! Come on! Come on! Get up so you can get back down! Bats must die! They must all die! Even the ones with lavender outlines! Hey, where'd you go? Bats, come back! I'm not gonna kill you! Slowly, that is. Yark! There's a sun scream from behind. Huh, let me go check it out. Uh, Bats, can you leave her alone? Mei Lin! Wah! It was scary! Mei Lin? What are you doing here? <laughs> I was just bored. Hey, Ark. You're really strong. You're going to Storkholm that's supposed to be in this forest, right? I'll go with you. I promise I won't get in your way. Well, so far you're doing a good job, but you're kind of violating my personal area. Have you ever heard of space? You know, not the same space from like Star Wars or anything like that? Because I could really use some. And you're giving me none whatsoever. It's like you're practically riding my ass. It's making me uncomfortable. And these bats are still alive. That also makes me uncomfortable. Oh, oh, get up, Warlock. You're making me uncomfortable. 
My comfort matters here! Everybody must die so I can be comfortable. I'll let you live for now, Malin. Get a Magirock. Good. Comfort! Did I see another bat? No, no. Just my imagination. Oh, well. Should I go this way? Yeah, I'll go this way. And there's the bridge area, again. And now we're even more dark area of the forest. Hey, Saber Dogs! Violating my personal area! You too! And you! Oh, you really violated my space! I caught harassment! And for that, I stab you to death! Well, it's better what women would have done if they were sexually harassed. Or, in other words, just complimented. Sadly, not all women are like that. And then, sadly, there are women that dress up skimpy in the gym and complain that guys stare. What did you expect to happen? Seriously, oh, maybe I should not go that way. That way leads to water. And even though I can swim, I cannot swim all the time. I have selective swimming skills in this game. That and I can't get up. Well, back up to the main area. Hey, wisps! Bye, wisps! Hi, bats. Die, bats. Let me go this way. Ooh, another treasure chest. Uh -oh, I'm really low on health. Yeah, I better eat another medium bulb. I only got two left. If push comes to shove, I'll have to use that last grass last grass pin. I don't want to use my large bulbs yet. Speaking of medium bulb, I just picked up another one. How convenient! You are still alive, that is not convenient. Or convenient. Wisps I can care less about because they just go around erratically in a straight line. Am I even going the right way? I better be. Sweet! Another magic rock! And two warlocks! Do you smell what the warlocks are cooking? Nope, because they didn't even cook me! I got a third magic rock. Okay, that, apparently that way was a dead end the whole time, and I'm POISONED AGAIN, and I'm getting hit twice. Let me get rid of you, and then I'll use, like, the friggin' poison cure. Man, I'm getting my ass handed to me in a place like this. I need, I need to be a lot better. <sighs> I hate you. I really need to pick up my game at this point. Well, I mean, you can be good at pretty much any game and struggle at it at some points. And even if you played Ocarina of Time religiously, chances are you struggled somewhere. What's happening here? I'm not gonna starve just because I'm struggling at Terranigma. I mean, I've never finished a game ever, though I really enjoy it. Five meters to Storkholm. Is it five meters exactly? Is it gonna be 5.1 or 4.9? Either way, I'm not gonna be satisfied unless it's 5.0. I'm gonna kill you anyway. Oh, I can't get the money. Wait, this looks familiar. What is this? This looks identical to the village I came from. What's the matter? You started running all of a sudden. This looks identical to my village. This can't be. Rural villages often look alike. Isn't it just coincidence? It doesn't just look close. This is what you call identical. You don't have to shout. Kind of think. I don't know anything about you, Ark. Oh, we have a lot to discuss, Malin. Uh, Maylin, want to be my meat shield? It's a pack of wolves! No, I thought they were rabbits! 
Ark! They're after us! What'll we do? Uh, have you ever thought of being a meat shield, Meilin? Because that might be a good idea. Warforce move and they'll tear our throats out. What to do? Oh wait, that's my thought. Beat a hasty retreat? Actually, I have an idea. I could use the dog whistle. You did it, Ark! The wolves are leaving! Yeah! So this is Ellie's house, even though this is based on the elders. Wait a minute. Aw, can I still open that door? Uh, let me try it again. This time from a little bit closer. Nope, doesn't break. So there's one difference. Yay, medium bulb! Portrait? What the hell is a big portrait doing in a chest like that? Is it a fold-in? A portrait of Princess Ellie's family! I feel a bit jealous. He looks so happy! Ellie doesn't look like the princess now. Listen, Ark. I can make these two people appear in front of Ellie. Ark, you saw them in Loran, right? The mirages I created? If I show her her parents, Maybe the princess will be cheered up! But that's only if you, Ark, don't plan to get married to her. Why, you want to marry me? What's the catch? Hmm, I wonder if I can still rest in that room. Oh great, another difference. And there's no save journal in that room either. And I can't even eat the apples! That's the worst difference! Apples are to be eaten! The door appears broken and will not open. Then again, the king did have everybody in this village slaughtered. So it's safe to say there's nobody here. This was the weaver's cottage! I wonder how Ellie is doing. Ark! What's the matter? I was just thinking about how I left my village. Ark, you have memory, mem many memories of places I don't know at all. But, but, I have my own memories that you don't know, Ark. Wouldn't you like to know some? Melin, let's hear them slowly some other time, okay? <laughs> you always smoothly drop the subject. We only just started getting to know each other a few minutes ago. Wait, you get to this dialogue again so you can't actually open the door? So I'm guessing none of these doors can open. Ah, uh, I can't skip the conversation. You mad? Well, at least these wolves won't attack me. That's a good thing. Well, I'm guessing you're gonna get the same message all the time. Here, eat up. And that pumpkin head will not respond. So I guess I can't really do anything in the village, despite... Just look at it. What do you think? Do you want to go back? Uh, yeah, let's go back. Let's meet at the castle. Don't forget to bring the portrait before your interview. Well, we parted at the forest entrance, and at least I did not have to go through the entire forest. Thank you, quick time. Now, so before I go to the castle, it would be in my best interest to go buy a lot of bulbs. Because I took a hell of a beating. Now buy seven. I don't really need to buy any small bulbs, if I got eight. But I definitely need to load up with some poison cures. Eh, three stardews. Can I buy anything from you that I don't already have? Nope. I'm well equipped. So, I think I should head over to the inn and save. 
mean, I've accomplished quite a bit, and my next step is to go to the castle. Yeah, I'm staying. And yeah, I don't even need to talk to you. I could have just went to the bed. And that dog's still there. Man, is that dog bored or something? I better go check to see if it's alive. At least the goldfish are still living. You'd think they would have died by now. I mean, they're goldfish. It is a living dog! Oh, it's so cute. Let's do that again. Come on. Come on. Do I have to leave the room and then you do it again? Aww. He thinks it's people. Actually, nice people for a change, rather than puking on the carpet. Okay, I'm going to stop the video right here, and next part, I'm going to meet you back at the castle. See ya, everybody.